Hello, 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 hello. There we go. Man, it's Matt, welcome back to the shop. I'm pumped. <laughs> oh, you see, we're still facing the fucking wrong way. Come on, there we go. Right then. Man, it's Matt, welcome back to the shop. I am wide awake. <laughs> so, uh, this, I've just uh, been away the end of this week, and uh, this is Sunday. This is four o'clock on Sunday, and I've only just started. Had to rush off to um, Dresden, Germany, to uh, do, just do some stuff for work and what have you. And I've got some days back in Lou, so I can basically just do more videos and such. Any road. So uh, what's happened? Um, update stuff. Uh, so the SV is cured. Um, I found out what's wrong with it. Uh, ish, it's that. <laughs> That's what's wrong with it. Um, so I've slipped a new one in, and she's just tickety boo. Um, RG500. We're going to carry on with. There's actually a few videos and comments and stuff. That's just to remind me of what the next video is. There's just a few uh, comments and stuff that I'm asking about the RG versus the RD and stuff like that. Very good topic and all the rest. It will go into that. Uh, materials testing. So we'll look at, we've got some, uh, another fucking, um, I can't click my fingers ever, ever since I've fucked my thumb. Bit wimpy, innit? Um, materials testing, so on and so forth. Oh yes, there is one, a few things I wanted to say. Um, so, uh, a year ago, well, January last, not the one just gone, the one before, so January 2017, I had 4,000 subscribers. Now it's on 30 something, um, just in a year's time. And the guy, you guys are fantastic. You've been sending me all sorts of stuff fucked pistons, weird stuff, tools, cabs, engine bits, blah, 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 blah. And I'm going to say right now, stop. <laughs> um, because. I've got basically, I've, just, I've been overwhelmed and I've just got too much to do. So what we're going to do is, the videos from now on, apart from whiteboard ones, all the project hands-on ones are going to be the RG, Tim's engine, uh, sorting shit out on the SV, sorting the XJ problem out. Um, got a new bike coming-ish, we'll see. Um, and the C90, the Easy Engine, the R5, uh, um, antifreeze experiments, all the rest of it. So this one and the carbs and stuff like that. So the guys that have sent stuff in, thank you so much. But if you have something and you want to send it in, just don't for the moment. If you want to, if you can keep hold of it, that's fantastic. If it's either, I'll get rid of it if you don't want it, Matt. Um, get in contact with me just in case it's something we can't miss the opportunity to have. But general stuff like pistons and this, that, and the, the, the general stuff that people are sending me, we're going to put that on hiatus for, I don't know, four or five, maybe six months, something like that. And then if you still have something, get in contact with me. I'll do a video and say, you know, now's the time. If you've got shit to send me, send it in. I've just got overwhelmed, you know what I mean? And I've got loads and loads of boxes. There's that bloody chainsaw we need to look at. There's a pump. There's all sorts. People keep on sending me stuff, which is fantastic. Just at the moment, I've just become... Oh, it's fucking hot as well. <laughs> um, I've just become overwhelmed. That's all it is. It's just um, absolutely overwhelmed. You know what I mean? With stuff and topics and questions and la, 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 la. In a sense, this is the reason why um, this year we're not going to have a toolbox giveaway. Hopefully next year we will do. Any road. Uh, what else is there? Just loads and loads of subjects. I can't think off the top made right now. I've got it all written down, but I didn't bother getting the list out. Oh yes, yes. One other thing. It, it needs to go in here. So a lot of people been saying, "What's up, Matt? Cheer up, you miserable cunt." Or, "Are you okay?" Um, no. Last weekend, I was just fucked off. Right? It was just. 
it wasn't the comment corner thing that had nothing to do with it. It was nothing to do with bollocks. It was nothing to do with even the SV. It was actually nothing to do... Well, the XG and the SV all failing kind of at the same time. Uh, yes, that's annoying. It was all the other fucking little things. It didn't matter what I did, you know what I mean? So, um... The fucking kettle shit the bed and they're all minor things but it was like all concentrated over a week you know there was things that were going fucking completely tits up um what else did i do there was oh, ordering stuff ordering them fucking samples and them sending me something that i didn't ask for or not the right size or charging me double for it and Euro car parts all of a sudden out of the blue sent me another five litres of that Evans shit and charged me for it. I was like, I, I got this, you know, but why are you sending me it again? Um, you know, just loads of insurance. I had to fuck around with the insurance company. They were being twats about, you know, blah, blah, blah. Just, it was just literally all in one week. It was, and it, it wasn't just that. It was actually physically, maybe because I wasn't in the state of mind or whatever. You know, you give something and you break it and you fucking pick something and drop it and you lose it or whatever. It was just a total mess. One of the things, so that was that. It wasn't, <laughs> it wasn't just life. It wasn't anything to do with the channel. That was just me just in a bad mood. And it was all culminating. And then on the Friday night, the, S, uh, the uh, XJ went pop. And I was like, oh, for fuck's sake, not this as well. And that was on Friday. Because I had so much planned for Saturday and Sunday... Um, then I had to sort everything out, and then it was like, well, do I go and get another bike out, which means I've got to go out there, check the tyre pressure, I've got to fill it with fluids, I've got to fucking warm it up and all of it. Then I've got to tax it, MOT it, and you know what I mean? And it's just like, fuck's sake, and insure it and all this shite. So it was like, right, the best thing to do is do what I've got, which is the SV right here, right now. Right, go and try and fix that. Then I opened that up, and I was like, oh, for fuck's sake. It wasn't something... And, that, and even when I did the magnet thing, there'll be a part two to that. Even when I did the magnet thing, that didn't sort it out. And I was like, oh, for... You know what I mean? It just got, to, <laughs> it just got like that. Any road, um, one other thing. Here's a little clip. And yes, I've gone and taken the plunge, so to speak, and got myself a 3D printer. Why have I got a 3D printer? I am not a fan of plastics and I am not a fan of 3D printers. It means that just I can do stuff to go on here, demonstration stuff. You'll see. Um, but it just makes it a whole lot easier. We tried, you know, I've done stuff on the board before. I've tried to do that vinyl like acetate kind of shit, which is a pain in the ass. It was a lot better in a sense than just trying to redraw slight movements and stuff. This is you know this the the level above that this is level level 10 <laughs> it just gives me the ability to be able to build two dimensions a lot of the times we'll go 3d as well but it gives me the ability to go two dimensions with certain things what i'm planning on doing what i'm doing at the moment i'm not going to spoil it but i'm doing something at the moment the next one i'm going to do as well is um you know just pistons con rods different length con rods and just have like in a sense a box with a kit in it so I and all with magnets on, so I can just pull them out. So piston, wrist pin, fucking this valves. You know what I mean? And I can just do that instead of drawing on the board is great and fine. All this, it's when you have to move something, you know. So if I'm demonstrating something like this with a piston, and I'm saying right at this degrees, at 45 degrees, it's all good. And then I have to show you at 90, I either have to draw it again or try and, you know, just it's a load of dicking around when it's just a simple movement. And with that, these plastic parts, I'll be able to do that. Uh, something else, something else, something else. I'm trying to remember what else it was. It's probably something I missed. If I do, I'll add a bit onto the extra, onto the end of this, so you know that I've missed it. Hope that makes sense, and I'll see you in a bit.